Then he says, Yahweh desires his people to self-reflect and monitor our hearts. He's making us accountable for our actions. This is Shabbat? Uh, no. No. Uh, well, I kind of said that regarding the questions that Yahweh asks. He makes rhetorical questions because the answer is clear when you think about it. So Yahweh makes those rhetorical questions so that we may understand that the commandments are clear. But when we put the flesh in the middle, when we decide not to trust Yahweh in the spirit that he placed in us, and instead trust in a person that may be uh, lying, then that becomes a problem. So that's why Yahweh asks those rhetorical questions. Now, I will read again what you said. Yahweh desires his people to self-reflect and monitor our hearts completely. He's making us accountable for our actions completely. But that has nothing to do with Shabbat. Every day you're accountable for your actions. That's why you should live in Shabbat so that your actions are for Yahweh and for his honor. So that you may not be condemned because of what you may have done through your actions. So that's how I can connect it to Shabbat, but not sure if I understood. 